In today's video, we are going to learn how to change this default background image in Xplain 12 to a custom image of your choosing. So to do this, if we head in to File Explorer, we go to the base Xplain 12 folder. Just a quick point to note is that you need to be on one of the latest versions of Xplain 12 as it was a recent feature that Laminar introduced. So in the base Xplain 12 folder, you go to Output, and then you'll see a nice folder here called backgrounds. This is where you're gonna to wanna to put all your images that you wanna have it cycle through and loop your custom backgrounds. So if you're wondering where to get some of these photos from, then you can go back in to explain and then just take some screenshots. So the easiest way to make these backgrounds is to open up explain and go into a flight. And then all you're gonna do is do shift and space on the keyboard and that'll take a screenshot. Or you can go up here and go file and then take screenshot. It's all here, careful you don't click video recording. But just take a screenshot and then back in into your file explorer. You're just gonna go here, output, and then screenshots, not background, screenshots. And then you'll notice here that we have got a nice photo. I've already made loads of folders here and organized it, but it won't be like that. It will just be an empty folder for you. This is your first screenshot. So just look for the aircraft type. I was in the Zebra at the time. Here is our photo. Double click and then there you go. There was our photo. And then what you can do from here is you can cut it into the backgrounds folder and move it over. So control and X or command and X on the Mac. Backgrounds. And then you can see it's empty there because we were on the default background and control and V. You can see that it has pasted the background in there. And so all we can do now is once we reload X-Plane, it will appear. Also, you can come here to the X-Plane official Discord server and there's a little text channel called explain 12 dash backgrounds and you can scroll through here and pick one you want that other people have chosen but you have to be careful here because people will have different screen sizes and so it won't necessarily work so all the photos that you put in the backgrounds folder has to be your screen size and the same size that you use inside your simulator because otherwise it won't work so for example here we can't use this guy's photo because it's taken on an ultra wide one and so as you can see there but you can just pick one of these and then right click save image and then save it into your backgrounds folder and it should load it in if the format is the same as your screenshots so loading up explain you can see that it's got the backgrounds and there you go and then you can put multiple images in the backgrounds folder and it will just cycle through them on a loop so it's very simple it does it automatically every time you launch explain 12. so there we go i hope you found that useful if you have any questions at all do drop them in the comments below and do give us a like and subscribe if you want more of these type of videos thanks for watching everyone